Hey guys, welcome to this episode of Album Review Corner, and today I'm here with Lance and Bob. Hello, people. And today we are going to talk about a article that we we all had seen on the internet. That you guys may have seen it before. It's Nikki Six of Motley Crue telling the world that the band is basically going to call it call it call itself or end after the book Pretty and good. a. For farewell tour. You guys want to elaborate on that? Uh, do you want, you want to summarize it first? Oh, it's just basically like you said. It's just him saying they're going to do a a film, the, the, the soundtrack to the film, and then another album and a farewell tour. Mm. And then yeah. they're going to call it quits. But that's been rumored for years, so who knows if it's really true yeah. this time. Because how long has the uh, Dirt been in production well, it didn't, right. it didn't, it wasn't uh, it written in 2001? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, of course, that, that's the book we're talking about, this is the, uh, is the story of Molly Crew. That, that's in production, I don't know if we made that clear. Um, but, yeah, that's, that's a re- really good book, isn't it? Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah. Awesome. And then I, I did a review on that, so if you guys want to check that out too. But um, yeah, yeah. I mean, to me, to me, it was like the fact that um, Nikki just came out and said it. I guess uh, we we're talking a little bit, little bit before. So it could be about Mick and his his bone disease, where he kind of basically is is wailing away. Um, yeah, you know, I don't. I, it could be something with that. It could be about maybe maybe a feud. Or what I think, I think honestly, it could be about just a just a stunt to maybe maybe they're recording a new album. Yeah, I mean I don't know. Yeah, who knows? Until I until I see something in the news about mm-hmm. you know the medical the bone disease really affecting him this much with Van Ness quit or the feud or whatever. i this has been rumored for years, so. Until yeah. I actually see some yeah. proven yeah. Uh, meat to the to the so-called rumor, then I'll believe it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because we know how many times they they've broken up. Yeah, Let's as does any band. About nineties, yeah. not ninety, like late eighties, and there was that when Tommy left. Mm-hmm. Yeah, people know Pam, I think. I think it's been about no, four this or five was, times. This, that was post divorce. Yeah, yeah. I know. He, I know he was in jail. Um, I want to say it's about four or five times. Yeah, and something like yeah. that. And I mean, like like I said, it it could be a stunt. I don't know. I don't think so. But uh, to me, it just uh, to me it was just shocking. He kind of came out and just said it. I wish it would just happen. If it was going to happen. Yeah, we'll see when the when the movie is finally released and when the soundtrack is when everything is done and we'll we'll find out if there's a fill Fall of twenty twenty. Hey, <laughs> but you know, any, any band or any artist comes back to touring once their once their money is all gone, they have to have more, so they go out and tour again. So I'm sure this isn't the end of Miley Crew, whether we think so or not. Yeah, because. I don't, didn't think it gave like a specific timetable for them calling it quits. It's just that yeah. there's an, an there's an inevitable uh, ending. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's what I know too. So like a short little timeline. Mm-hmm. Um. Another, another thing I had just seen. I think it was yesterday. They are they're of course on the tour with um with Kiss. Um, they've been, they were, they were in Chicago a couple months back and throughout, throughout North America. Vince Neal is in a uh, hospital. You want to talk about that? Yeah, kidney stones. Yeah. He had a kidney stone, yeah, on, uh, stage. Mm-hmm. And he, he collapsed. And I like, think, where was it? Texas or something? Where it was, was no, actually, it was Australia. Australia, yeah. Australia. And yeah. it, but it he's supposed to be back here tonight or tomorrow night. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. So I mean that's that could be part of it too is that you know the health of all these guys they're in their what fifties now yeah oh, and they yeah, all had extreme drug problems mm-hmm. 
So it amazes me that all these rock stars, even Motley Crue, Rolling Stones, uh, all the rock stars are still living because of all the stuff they put their bodies through, and, you know, all their yeah. rock star ways. Keith Richards, especially, well, who comes to mind. Let's remember, Nicky came back from the dead. Yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> two, almost two times, right? Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, twice. Yeah. I they even wrote a song about it. Kickstart my heart. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> yeah, and then, I mean, I'm sure as far as Nicky, as far as Nicky individually goes, that's he's got his own photography stuff, and he's got you know his books. He's got Six AM. Who has a new Six album coming out? Yeah. That's supposed I to be cannot wait to get a hold of that. That's gonna be. I think it's gonna be pretty good. We'll we'll see. Um, you know. Yeah, it should be exciting. And, and then I don't know. It's gonna be interesting. Of course, Tommy. I don't. I don't know. I don't know what he's up to really. A uh, message of mayhem, I think. Okay. Yeah. Or some. Of his, I know he. I know he has that group. Group. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's got some. He's got other bands. Super group. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That he's doing good. Vince has got the Vince Neil Project, which is basically his Motley Crue cover band. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so I, I don't know. I mean, I'm not I'm not fearful of the end here, but it's to me I found it interesting. So I figured we'd do a video about it here. Um, yeah, this is something I've heard. Uh, is it a Nikki, Tommy, or Vince that they're going to try to tour as long as Mick can tour? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're probably right. Even if, if this is true, uh, it is probably dealing with the doctor telling Mick that he's got a limited time left with mobility. Yeah. If I mean, because even if they had to wheel him out in a wheelchair, if you can't move these, you can't play guitar. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. So, I don't yeah. know. Um, I mean, he, we, we, we saw him, me and Bob here, we've seen him about, what, three times three now? Three times. And yep. Um, I mean, they look, they look, they, people have said they sound bad, and, I mean, Vince isn't, isn't the best at taking care of his voice, I will, I will say that, but he still, he still sounds pretty good, and I, I just hate when people say that. He's no axle, though. Yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Vince is, remember Vince is a at saint. backstage when, uh, the fire happened to James Hetfield, he was backstage smoking and drinking when he was having throat problems. Yeah. yeah. If you're having throat problems, you shouldn't be smoking and drinking. Yeah. 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 Right. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. I don't know. You know, so we'll see. It should be, it should be interesting as we go forward here. And, uh, that's basically, you guys want to closing thoughts, I guess, for the video. Well, basically, uh, I heard uh, they said 6 a.m. will be touring. Mm-hmm. Okay, good. I didn't. That, that. But that's I've been hearing that from uh, DJ M- James Michael and Nikki too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've heard that there, there might even be the opening act for Motley Crue on their next tour. I've heard that a couple times. Awesome. That would, that that'd be, be, that'd be I was I was actually surprised um, that they didn't do that for the Kiss tour when they when they did that, but. I yeah. think uh, uh, EJ would. There was a Guns N' Roses tour okay, during yeah. that time or something like that. Yeah, I mean, I mean that makes so, sense. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep, yep. All right. <laughs> well, that's basically it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching this episode. Um, if you guys enjoy my channel, uh, my album review corner stuff, please subscribe. Of course, Lance. He's got some. He's got videos, right? When, when your next video, Lance? You know? Uh, probably got some wrestling and racing stuff coming up. But I know I got like a uh, Megadeth, D- Megadeth review coming up, and then me and you, and I don't know if Bobby wants to too. The uh, Kid Rock, uh, Rock and Roll Jesus. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Sounds exciting. <laughs> and then you got Bob. Bob Little doing less than video. 30 songs, though. It's not. It's good, so. <laughs> that's good. All right. Well, guys, that's it. Thank, again, thank you for watching this episode. Please subscribe to all our channels. I have the links below. I'll have the link to the um, story also. I'll put that below as well. Um, 
yeah, basically it. Bye, guys. Yeah, time will tell. <laughs> yeah. Bye-bye. Later. <laughs>